It's Jennifer Don Gaviola, and I am going to take a dare today also for our Quiet in Fierce Truth or Dare Visibility Challenge. Before I share, I wanted to uh, say how happy I am that everyone, so many people engaged on the first day, which was yesterday. Um, so if you just joined the group or haven't started, no worries. Just um, there's a couple posts that I shared um, explaining how the challenge is. But you, there's still time for you to sign up at dawningsoul.com forward slash quiet and fierce. And and is the ampersand. Um, that way you get all the details for the daily emails. Uh, remember, um, at the end of each day, well, in the evening, um, you'll, I'm going to be uh, announcing the winner for each, uh, for each day. So let's talk about today's challenge. So today is uh, all about, the theme is trust, trust, because as an introvert, you need to have a sense of a feeling of a sense of safety within yourself in order for you to put yourself out there in a bigger way. And so uh, I thought it was important to include this as a part of the challenge. That way you can identify your fears of being visible and then reframe them because uh, that's really important. So um, first off, I was thinking about like what I wanted to share as far as why I feel like what are some fears that I have uh, about being um, being seen in a bigger way. I've been doing this for over seven years, but as you grow, you know, each level, it's, you get, you experience more challenges, more things to heal, right? And so, um, for me, I was reflecting on this, to be seen in a bigger way and to grow like to another level, I feel like right now the fears that come up are, can I handle it? Can I handle new levels of growth if I've never been there before? Uh, it's less about the fearing judgment. I still have that, like fearing judgment and feeling fearing criticized. I'm sensitive, as most introverts are. But I feel like what it is now, being in this place with my business and my growth, is can I handle like bigger ways, bigger opportunities, bigger growth if I've never done it before because how I used to function is I'd have to prove it to myself. If I have not proved it to myself, then I don't feel like I can do it. But the reframe that I want to share, and hopefully this will help you too, is that I've come to a place now that I understand me growing into these expansive infinite ways are not my by my own doing. There's no way, you know, like how I even got to this place in my life and business, there's no way. Um, I know that my life is being directed by a force greater than myself. Uh, I really believe God built all of us with the capacity to go to like new levels, new heights that we can't even conceive, but we have to believe it's possible. So really, I want to share with you um, for today's challenge uh, about trusting, uh, trusting the process, trusting yourself, trusting that you're supported is you are built with the capacity to handle more. You just have to believe. The work is about believing, believing that's possible for you. You're not supposed to figure things out in your head. It's more about having the faith and trusting that what is meant to come through you is gonna come through you. you but you, we have to keep that channel open to allow that growth, that expansion to happen. So, you know, I am my own testimony because I used to be a, a control freak, a perfectionist, everything, very controlling, uh, wanting everything to be like perfect. And I realized that for me to go to like the new levels that I feel are in my future, it's, it's really about trusting in the process of life, trusting in the process and having the faith that um, I'm not meant to figure this out. There's no way. <laughs> You know, I didn't create myself, you know, that's what my best friend told me. She's like, Jennifer, you can try to control everything, but you actually didn't create yourself. God created you. So just like let him handle all the major stuff, you know, just be clear about what, what it is you want and then have faith. So I just wanted to share that with you. Hopefully it, it'll help you because I know that as an introvert, it's kind of challenging to put yourself out there because you have to manage your energy. We fear, you know, judgment. But what I've learned is you have to create that sense of safety within yourself. And um, 
it starts with recognizing your value, which, which we talked about yesterday, but then also cultivating that sense of faith and trust that you're being supported by a force greater than yourself, for real. So that is my share. I wanted to, every day my goal is to share a truth, like a comment um, in the group, but also take the dare uh, and encourage all of, the dare is to do a video, but I really wanna encourage all of you to share each day, just so it builds your confidence to put yourself out there. Because if you have a brand, you have a business, you have to put yourself out there so people know who you are and what you have to give, right? And the more consistently you do that, then you're building this um, real and authentic ongoing relationship. It's just a conversation. So I hope that's helpful. I'm going to hop on later tonight. Uh, um, well, not by video, but I'm going to announce the winner for, uh, for today's uh, visibility challenge about trust. Um, again, just check out the post if you missed the details about today, but definitely sign up at dawningsoul.com forward slash quiet and fierce if you missed it. Um, but uh, yeah, I just want to encourage you to know that you are doing great. And uh, if you haven't started, just just start where you, where you feel inspired. The last time where... You, um, we ran this, there was a few people that were a little behind and they like knocked it out in like, <laughs> um, I don't know, I think one lady, she knocked out all of them in like a day. She just got caught up in all three or four challenges in one day. I'm not saying you have to do that, but I just want you to find ways where you engage because that's really how you're gonna build your confidence. Okay, guys, if you have any questions or comments, let me know. I saw a few people hop on. I um, just want to connect with you, but I hope you're enjoying the challenge, and we're going to go all week. And um, like, like I said, I'm going to announce the winner later tonight. Okay, well, I will um, chat with you in the group in our Quiet Voice Big Impact community. But again, keep, keep pushing outside your comfort zone, and uh, you're really not meant to hide, okay? You really are meant to... Uh, step forward and share uh, your your voice in a way that feels good to you because in your own way you're meant to lead. Okay guys, I'll talk to you soon.